Merlin and Dan here. What's up, Polished Diamond? We got IFW team here informing you. It's one of those those epic chats, trying to explain something epic where people hear our words. Yeah, I've been at work all day too. Shit. And I got to work tomorrow. I got to work yep. the last three days. I got to work the next three days. But, you know, we're, yeah, I'm right in the midst of the middle of, uh, you know, get working and just here talking. I'm grateful to be talking with Merlin and getting this information out, making you a talk video. Talk about eternal. Like the fact yeah, this we're is awesome. Thank matrix. you, man. Like, That's what everybody's missing. We're already right. in the kingdom right now. Like right outside yeah, it'd be great power. if people You're would take that power back, you know. But just... everybody's blinded. Can't see where they are right here, right now. You're already inside of the kingdom, and this place has been made into hell because of the mental constructs and the programs that are oscillating in everybody's minds. That's given to you from your government, through your school educational system. The media has delivered so much lies to your minds. The people are brainwashed with, with the level of lies. It's just almost incomprehensible. The layers of onions, I mean, the awakening movement is happening. People are starting to see through some of the deeper perceptions. Finally, there's some signs of an actual awakening happening, seeing through the governments and the secret societies and the whole globe lie. They're finally seeing the shape of the reality, the flat earth. And now you're going to have to learn about blood over intent, that it wasn't a false alarm. We put up our blood to attach to the consciousness flow coming from the center of the earth. And that's where the knowledge goes. Flat earth, holy grail. The holy grail turns out to be real. And that's what everybody's missed, that it's real. And it's been there our whole lives. That's what's mind blowing. It's epic because blood over his head wasn't a false alarm. Mark Braun was right. He told everybody, he said at some point, you're gonna have to realize that I'm not full of it. Speaking the truth, he gave us the knowledge that we needed to be able to see the deep connections of how the sun is operating, that the sun is conscious, that the rays of light are a carrier wave of knowledge and information, that those light rays are connected to the black sun beneath our feet, that it's an exchange feedback loop. It's like the same sun. One side of a light hole is a black hole, and we're inside of this matrix of creation. We're already on the hollow deck in the matrix. You're already in it, and it looks like exactly what you see. Everything's conscious. The air, the earth, the fire, the water. That's, that's just, just standard knowledge for me at this point. This information is soaking in. Like Mark Braun told everybody, it's going to soak in. And those that really see it are going to be able to see it. It near drives you to mental insanity, having this level of knowledge and nowhere to put it. Because we were censored on the internet. YouTube literally committed genocide by stopping the knowledge of the ages from going across their platform. The divine was speaking through the mouths and we basically isolate the next out down to a few live chats and we're lucky that we even have any of this left so like i say i'm thank for you dan yeah Marilyn. people that are on these for chats sure, dude. yeah this so is awesome bro like, like you. I mean, you know like you were saying like we thing. literally have nowhere to put this and, message uh, i know <laughs> like you know, other than making the videos that we do, and, and you know, however we can, just I'm sure the others are suffering. Sure, you know, we we should be talking about the Holy Grail. Yeah, we're Everybody, trying to give you some hope. Like I know, I know the other blood family is suffering. They're having a hard, hard time. Look at the hard times we're going through, and we're pretty. Powerful. Yeah, nobody's perfect, you know. It's no. not an easy thing being alive in the land of the dead. So we're just here saying, don't give up. We haven't given up. We're driving this message with you know, force and authority, as you said, from the Creator. We're here speaking by divine order, and you're going to listen to us, people of Earth. You're going to hear this message, and you're going to do something about it, or you're going to die. Everybody's name is in the book of death by default, so that should concern you, because it's been almost 10 years now since the book of light has been open, and it was spelt out very clearly that Leviticus 17 11 explains the power of your own blood, your blood, and 
that has to be spilled to make atonement. Here in that's the need why we're publishing a drop of our own blood over our own written intent. And that's that's what this message needs to be delivered. The intention is a living wave field of energy. So it's recorded into the ether pool that's all around us all the time. And the sunlight is recording this collective consciousness. We're all co-creating reality, but the reality that we're co-creating is a nightmare, Orwellian, dystopian, you know, globalist government control where your elected officials have become your dictators and now they're telling you what to do and everybody's just a complacent sheep accepting this insanity as normal they don't have a backbone to stand up to their own government. That's it. To the tyranny and they've crossed boundaries. They've like... Murdering people, there's human trafficking, there's pedophilia problems, there's adrenochrome harvesting. Like, there's some serious shit wrong with this world. And if you don't have a problem with that, then I have a problem with you. Because I'm sick of this hell on earth. And we're here to bring forth heaven on earth. So you're gonna get our way, we're gonna die. Because we're the only ones speaking about a connection to eternal life before you don't die. And in order to have this connection to the oscillation, you need to spill your blood into the ether to get proof of life, and you need a witness. That's why you're supposed to publish it to the ethernet. It's conscious. If you could see how the electrical currents conscious energy, conscious we feel the tension, the reasons for the ones and zeros but to be going down the fiber optics, all the oscillations of light, the frequency patterns of the flashes of the electrical current is triggered because of your intention. So literally your intention is carried through the internet into this consciousness plane of intelligence. It's invisible. It's beyond but the and information in the Akashic records. We're just aware that it's real, that it's around us, that it's recording us. So once you get to these levels, you got to start focusing your like intention in a conscious, awake, and aware manner. I think it was Ian Lungold, who was a Mayan calendar researcher. I think he's been dead for quite a few years. But he said something interesting that to be conscious means that you're aware that you're aware. I'm not really remarkable. Conscious means that you're aware that you're aware. So that's kind of like you're hyper aware. Because now you're aware that you're aware. So you begin to have this sort of hyper level of awareness of a consciousness that there is something, a creator field of equity that's listening. It's a pool. And you can ripple it with your blood, your sweat, and your tears. And that's the only equity of any value. This money is all just a man-made tool. The Federal Reserve has been printing money out of air for years, forever. They've had this unfair advantage. They've just bought everything with this stolen wealth, and all they gave you was lies. Fake space, NASA, garbage, government propaganda, psyops, false flag wars, just one kick, terrorist attack after another, order out of chaos, street theater gang stalking like you're literally in hell and have no way out of here until you put your blood over your intent to join the living souls to really make a difference in this world is make this fall your blood if you have a problem with blood over intent think we're a cult think again because you're already in a blood cult the vatican stole your soul print at birth and took your blood they did a blood over intent against your will Built your blood and attached what? it to a legally dead, birth bond, the debt slave contract, and People your government is literally they, I just farming you. See how they don't cattle, understand that. All the way to your graves. Basic shit. Of... So, I mean, this is so deep. Right. Yeah, it's because, you know, it's... It's, deep, like, this, just the level it's of beyond, the yeah, it's beyond knowledge. measure, like, of how the, rep- the damage about this. that has been done to these people. They, they, yeah, right, and that's why we make videos and try to make people, like you said, aware of that. We're aware of what is going on. Like, we're trying to make people aware, like, how do they not see the fucking... They know that shit's fucked up in this world. They just can't sense, like, why or how. Like, you know, obviously... All the shit that's been given to us is programming where people have just been non they, they were never given the knowledge. The real knowledge, right. That they needed to, you know, 
be able to the break free from it. all they the bullshit, never right? Given the anyway. Yeah, because I mean, you know, the bit worst thing is to be lied to. You know, you don't want to be lied to, and yeah. you know, a lot of things people are living a lie. You know, in a lot of situations where you know it's hard to come out of that because they know that they don't even know how to address it, the situation really, because they've never had to. It's you know, it's just there. It's just glaring, but. You know, people just got to learn, like, you know, that... The government shut off half their brain. The educational system was designed to make people stupid. They only gave you half the knowledge, enough to be a functioning robot. You know, factory worker, construction worker. They gave you some basic life skills, how to tie your shoes, how to make peanut butter and jam sandwiches. Like, they gave you some basic things to function. But then if you got into, you know, post-secondary school and the universities, they show you a graduation that your cap, square mortarboard hat on your head, that your cap is cut off and you're not getting any knowledge. It's a symbol of the black cube of Saturn that you've been successfully indoctrinated and that's it. You're not getting any more knowledge. Now you have to go pay back your student debts and work for these corporations that just keep you busy running in circles and everything's engineered to keep you away from the flat earth holy grail at the center this is all about flat earth and the holy grail that's the information people need to be looking into because the flat earth is real whether you're a gold card or not it's unfortunate the level of lies that globe earth is put in people's heads it's, it's complete insanity or that but the goal is spinning. the cgi hoax it doesn't exist i mean i'm not on a spinning ball i'm so far past globe earth like i don't even really waste much more time on the flat earth forums my words are censored i mean i'm literally arguing with the flat earthers themselves because my knowledge is so advanced they start attacking me because everybody wants to be this like superstar flat earther and selling t-shirts and not, you know have their own tv shows and all this nonsense it's just People need the knowledge of the ages so that they don't die.